Hey everyone, I'm Mark Sievers, and today I'm gonna to give you a little tour of what I call my everyday entertaining cabinet. So you've been really curious as to what is behind me in all of my videos, and today I'm gonna to give you a little sneak peek into one of my cabinets. So I live in the city, I live in downtown Chicago, and just because I live in an apartment doesn't mean I'm gonna sacrifice on style. So as you can see, I have one of my cabinets has these, it's filled with all kinds of goodies. And I'm gonna give you a little sneak peek into what's behind my doors. So this is my cabinet, which is closest to my kitchen. My kitchen is right here. And what I love about this cabinet is this has everything I need for Ryan and I to entertain ourselves during the week or have a few other guests during the week. And I don't have to go into other cabinets, into other spaces. Everything is right here. So let me give you a little tour of a voila behind my doors. I could say drawers, but that's a different video. So as you can see, beautiful shelves lit from above. I think this is really important to add ambiance to this, especially at night when I have the main lighting off. I still want everything in this cabinet to sparkle. So I have things like slightly larger balloon wine glasses, a beautiful water pitcher, and then these are these gorgeous French wine glasses that I love so much. And the best part is everything in this cabinet is also dishwasher safe from a glass uh, glassware standpoint. So that's the top shelf. Second shelf, I have some water glasses. I have a little silver uh, plated rimmed glass. I actually don't polish them because I love the way they look. I hope you can see this on camera. I love the way they look all tarnished and earthy and elegant and I just love it. And then I have, of course, the matching French champagne flutes. Again, these are perfect for really anything, but uh, I do love a good glass of bubbles. And then I have great little nut dishes and, and things um, so that when Ryan and I are at home after a long day, we want to sit down at the kitchen island and have a little glass of something. We have a little nibble too. Great little ice bucket and then some silver nesting bowls. These are um, just silver plated, uh, beautiful nesting bowls in different sizes that are great for little nibbles as well. I have great beautiful textured basket. It's a water hyacinth basket. It's my favorite type of basket. And in it I have just unironed uh, linen napkins more little snack bowls. Um, this, is a hot, this is a hot chocolate pot, which that'll be covered in a different video because I bought it in Paris and I have to tell you all about it. It's wonderful. And then as we're gonna go all the way down, come on downtown, Julie Brown. And I have, these are like little appetizer plates and little cereal and ice cream or yogurt bowls for the morning. I have salt and pepper. These adorable little salt and pepper cellars were purchased, were actually given to me as a gift by my friend Holly. Uh, she went to Paris and she brought back these adorable little salt and pepper things with little spoons. It's fantastic. And some little ton of appetizer plates. And then this section here is glass canisters for my little nibbles storage. So I have little rice mix, I have uh, lime and chili cashews, I have dried apricots, I have almonds, I have Marcona almonds with truffle, little crackers, brioche toast, dried figs, some regular crackers, and then I always keep one or two empty containers because I like to be able to be at the grocery store and if I find something that looks super yummy, I want to make sure that I have a spot for it at home. So this we use all the time. Um, this is one of my favorite little hidden treasures of this apartment. And then way down below, I kind of have little ramekins and things, soup bowls. Even though people hate saltines, I still love them. They remind me of my childhood. So I have always have a jar of saltines, especially after a night of indulging in a little too much bubbles. Those the next morning with ginger ale and a champagne glass are perfect. <laughs> and this is really what I need in regards to entertaining on a daily basis for just Ryan and I at home. And then I have open storage for dishes. So this is great whiteware, classic whiteware, perfect for 
pastas and and salad plates and these beautiful where are my coupe bowls? So I love this coupe bowl plate. I don't know if you can see the shape of it. I think it's super chic. Um, and everything you put in this looks amazing. So um, that's kind of a little style tip. A coupe bowl is a wonderful way to add instant style to your everyday entertaining. So, and I'll give you guys just a quick little peek in there. So that's my kitchen. Heart of the home, for sure. Uh, you guys have been really wanting a kitchen tour, so coming up very soon, I promise. So if you liked this video, which I hope you did, I hope you got some great inspiration for home. Um, what I love too is that none of this is expensive. It's all from, it's all curated collection, let me put it that way. So flea markets, online auctions, um, and just regular department stores. So it doesn't cost a lot of money to be super fabulous. You just have to have a little bit of patience, a curated eye, and take your time, do not rush. So I'm Mark Sievers, like this video, subscribe to my channel, and head over to marksievers.com for other kitchen ideas, entertaining tips, and of course, information on my two cookbooks. I will see you next time. Bye guys. I think it's time for a glass of bubbles. No, I know it's time for a glass of bubbles. <laughs> Bye guys.